but our funding needs are already established and in place. So I have no need to, to tap the capital markets, but we have strong interest in from the capital markets. As you know, we signed a 14 billion loan facility last year, the first ever Saudi denominated green loan of that scale. Um, so the, the capital markets like what we're doing. They love the fact of, uh, you know, that we focus on ESG and it helps them as well as it helps us. And so there's no, no shortage of interest. As I said, luckily I don't need it at the moment. I've got to deliver on our promises. And I think the capital situation will evolve as we look at our subsequent projects. But there's going to be opportunities to recycle the capital from our, from our first phase projects because once they're up, up and running and stabilized, they become very attractive investment vehicles. We could look at real estate investment trusts, as I've mentioned, which opens up the spectrum of, you know, a broader spectrum of investors from your institutional investors all the way down to retail investors. And I think that might be a great way for everybody to benefit from Vision 2030.